Welcome, everyone. Thank you for taking a look at my video, which is going to go over the television show Ash vs. the Evil Dead and why I think it is the best show on television. Why have you disturbed us? So a spoiler warning out there to those of you who have not watched the Evil Dead films or the television show Ash vs. the Evil Dead, don't watch my video. <laughs> I don't want to spoil you. Now, I know it's a big statement to say that Ash vs. the Evil Dead is one of the best shows on television. Very big statement. There's some really great shows out there, but I truly believe it is. And here's why. Now, I'm a mom, and I'm a writer. I'm very busy. I don't have time to watch television. So the shows that I do watch, I watch The Walking Dead and American Horror Story. Those are the, t the two that I only have time for. But then I'm sitting in my couch in September of 2015, and all of a sudden, a advertisement for Ash vs. the Evil Dead comes on. And I'm just about ready to fly off my couch and just demand it right then and there. I was so excited to see that. Because much like a sequel to Army of Darkness, it was just a myth. Like a break-in three movie. It was just a myth. But then to actually see it, I thought that was great. I was so pumped. I made sure my kids were in bed <laughs> by a certain time so I could watch my recorded version of Ash vs. the Evil Dead, the first one on Halloween night. And I did, and I thought it was fantastic. It just blew me away, the dialogue. Just Bruce Campbell himself. It really was the Evil Dead and not just some crap that somebody tried to write to knock off to get some fans and to get a show started again. It was great. It was not crap. <laughs> I was so happy. So the second episode just took me again by surprise. I just thought it was fantastic. Now, I don't, again, since I don't have time to watch television, I had to watch Ash vs. the Evil Dead. It's on on Saturday nights, and my cable provider don't you ever change this Ash vs. the Evil Dead if you ever see this video. Don't ever change it. My cable provider puts Ash vs. the Evil Dead on demand at 12.01 a.m. on Saturday mornings. So if I can stay up till Friday nights at midnight, I can actually watch Ash vs. Evil Dead before it comes on at 8 o'clock on Saturday nights. Um, I... I it's so easy for me. I can just lock myself in my closet with my husband and we can watch this awesome show that he adores just as much as me. And he does not watch anything except football or basketball. Trust me. So I have to say that I am a big fan of The Walking Dead. Big fan. I'm all about dialogue and characters and character development and storyline. Very big, on, especially on character development. And I really think that The Walking Dead has the upper hand on that. That's why I love it so much. But Ash versus Evil Dead, I mean, you actually have Ash Williams, the guy. Bruce Cam It's actually Bruce Campbell playing Ash Williams. You have Sam Raimi, who is still working on it. You have the same people who were working on some of the original films, some of them actually working on the show. Obviously not all of them, but that magic that existed in the first three films carried on into this show, and I love it. I think it's fantastic, so I have to start reviewing it. I'm a little late, obviously. For me, tomorrow is the season finale. I get it tonight, though, so I'm going to put it up tonight after midnight. I know it's a little late, but I did. I'm going to get, I got a Ash vs. Evil Dead backdrop. So I'm going to upgrade my backdrop, and I'm go after tonight, after I do the season finale, I'm going to go back and repost episodes one through nine, and obviously continue with the second season. Because again, I think that this is just one of the best shows out there. Granted, again, I know there's some great shows out there, but if you're not watching Ash vs. the Evil Dead, you're an idiot! This is a great show show one-liners out the out the wazoo killing deadites everywhere ash with his uh chainsaw hands slicing off zombie or deadite heads it's great it's everywhere in every single episode 
My only complaint about the show, I do have a complaint, and it's one, that the show is only 30 freaking minutes long. It needs to be an hour. However, I was watching Bruce Campbell interviews online, and he, I think, him and the writers are kind of scared to have uh, an episode longer than 30 minutes, you know, because they had 10 shows, so if, you know, if there were an hour each, that'd be 10 hours, and I think that was a little too much right now for them. So hopefully it'll change, but I would love to have an hour of the show. I think that'd be better. And also one thing, I'm a big Bruce Campbell fan, and if you have not read his book, this is my favorite book of Bruce Campbell, If Gins Could Kill, Confessions of a B-Movie Actor. Great book. You should go out and get it if you haven't. Uh, it's fantastic. I love Bruce Campbell. So thank you for watching my review. I would love to know what you guys think of the show Ash vs. Evil Dead. And when did you start watching the trilogy? For me, it was 1991. I was like 11 or 12. And I was looking for a scary movie, and my father handed me The Evil Dead. My world changed forever. Yes, my father gave his 11-year-old daughter The Evil Dead. My father is fantastic. I love him so much. Anyway, <laughs> let me know how you guys started out with the trilogy. What do you think of the show? And do you think Ash vs. the Evil Dead is one of the best shows right now on television? Let me know in the comments below. If you would like to support my channel, give me a thumbs up. Not a finger up. Give me a thumbs up, okay? Thank you very much. And send me your comments if you have any. I really appreciate it. Thank you for watching my video and more will come. Thank <laughs> you.